talk about something that I'm really passionate about, which is wine. We all love to have a great glass of wine, but it's very difficult sometimes to find the right wine for you. As we evolve as wine drinkers, our palates change, and um, so these are three of my picks that I love from Loudoun County. They're from Dry Mill Vineyards, and I know the winemaker personally, Dean, and we do sell these bottles of wine and his, actually all of his wine here at the spa. So my first pick is his Petit Verdot. This is an unbelievable red wine. Um, it is not quite Napa Valley, but I'm going to tell you, for Loudoun County, this is going to really give you a great punch. It's soft, very soft in tannins. You can drink it alone. It's great with red meat. Um, but my favorite is just, you know, some great hors d'oeuvres, fruit, and a bottle of Petit Verdot with your favorite person, of course. Um, the white, this is my favorite white that he carries, which is called Tremignette. I am not a Chardonnay girl by any stretch of the imagination. I don't like oaky. I just do not like Chardonnay. So this is a very crisp, white, light. You need to drink it very, very cold. Um, has a little bit of a floral tone, little spice to it. Again, you can drink it alone or you can drink it, you can pair it up with spicy food, Asian food, chicken, fish, pretty much goes well with everything. And you know, I think there used to be rules of the road with, you know, with fish and chicken, you drank white wine and red meat, you drank red wine. Um, I, think, I, don't, I think these days I drink white with everything sometimes or red with everything sometimes. His last pick that I love is dessert wine. Um, usually I don't like dessert wine because it's way, way, way too sweet. Usually the residual sugar is somewhere around 10, 12%. This is very low and it's a raspberry flavor. So ice cold, just a little bit after dinner, perfect. It pairs well with things like a chocolate souffle or chocolate cheesecake, um, chocolates. Anything like that, this is wonderful with. It is fantastic for the holidays. You can see what a beautiful color it is. You can put a, a nice bow on it, put it in a nice gift bag. It makes a great gift. Everybody loves wine at Christmas. So I would recommend, of course it depends on your palate, any one of these, but he also does have Chardonnay if you love Chardonnay. Um, also has a great Merlot that was just released in the fall. So we're going to be doing wine tasting here all season and you can also taste all of his wines at Dry Mill Vineyards as well. So thank you and cheers.